than half of all mental health problems begin in childhood before the age of 14. And one of the things we're looking at is how experiences of early adversity, such as domestic violence and maltreatment, can lead to changes in brain structure and function that can embed long-term vulnerability to mental health problems. It's something we're calling latent vulnerability. Those who had been exposed to maltreatment and domestic violence showed heightened patterns of activation in those brain regions uh, related to threat vigilance and threat detection. And what was striking is that we see the same pattern in other studies done by other groups where they have looked at soldiers before and after combat. And that might help both the soldiers and the children uh, function in those environments, but the difficulty is that it may also embed long-term vulnerability. We believe it is reversible. We know that many children who experience abuse and neglect and domestic violence have a resilient and positive outcome, and we expect that their brain will change and respond to positive emotional experiences such as social support and being in a secure and safe environment.